Pops and Vixens, it's Little Vixen here, and welcome to our next episode of Pokemon Imperium. We are here today for episode number 12 of our walkthrough. In today's episode, we are going to take on the rest of this gym and try and beat it. And the last episode we got here, made our way through, found a few trainers. Um, so yeah, that is what we are going to do today. Before we begin, I'll give you guys a quick team recap because we had some evolutions that happened um so yeah so up first we have camera for us our camera our ice type rather than fight it looks pretty cool he didn't want pan jump i figured out how he evolves and i will hopefully evolve him after this fight because we need a dark type in the team apparently to evolve him never knew that about pan jump. um hepatitis r typhlosion me and Fee evolves at level 50 into Min shower I thought it was maybe 40 rather than 50 and Inyo it will always be a mock chop because we probably have to trade to do this and to evolve it and Everat is we have up last so yeah oh no let's just hit that let's see if maybe we can get no nope. no nope. this blue one then that we hit no, we don't definitely do not have that blue one. Okay. Mm, needs to be a green somewhere that we hit. That one needs to appear to the vice captain. So you want to challenge the Imperial Gym Captain? No, oh my god, you won't. I will. Yes, unless you got any Pokemon that can land a fire type move, you are being earthquaked. Oh, I forgot to put the quick claw on you. Didn't I? That's still. That's with the air balloon. Uh, that's fine. We will um, switch actually. This charge should not really do too much. Leftovers. Fake out. Pop the air balloon. Great punch. Oh, you're gonna thunder punch me. That's fine. Still shouldn't do that much damage. Dream punch. No, no, but near, near enough. Near enough. Oh, I'm just going for a poison jab then. Entry ball. Okay, that's fine. I mean, shall. So you are psychic in this type in here, right? Because we have a mean food, so we have switch. How have you got a mean shall? Well, it goes to psychic light. Uh, then I thought you had bite on your crunch. No, I know it's not super effective. I want to get some damage off. So. Um, yeah, it's just a bit super effective. Uh, 
And then minute trick to come out. I should a bit run this we get paralyzed for a crit. And we got paralyzed. I love it when that happens. Of course you're gonna know that on you, but it's fine. That's fine. Hmm, don't tell me out with a thunder fang, please. Paralyzed. Attack. Thank you. Excuse the noise if you hear any guys. Go back nice and healthy. Let's hit this blue switch and see what happens. That one does not open that door. Hopefully it opens the doors up here. No? No. Alright, let's hit the screen switch back down here. Closes that door. Opens that door. Opens the door at the top here. Alright, let's go and get this item first. Oh no! Where do you think you're going? I'm going to go back with your gym leader. That's where I am going. Oh, the thing is gonna have freaking levitate on you. And that thing is gonna no flamethrower. No, no. And there's one of them can learn flame wheel, I think. I get rid of this thing. We have done. Maybe I'm right uh, you got the attack boost. I'm freaking ominous wind, really? Like, I mean, come on. I thought I was super afraid if I did that much. You're, I know for a fact you have levitate, right on. Like, I've lunch. Oh, just not quite enough. No. Like, you don't do just enough. So don't take out my typhlosion. Oh, no, you're going to, aren't you? That was... For fuck's sake. Like, seriously. Like, you're one level above. Stop getting the boosts. Like, seriously. Thank you, Dogra. So I'm gonna go back in here now. As we are back nice and healthy, like I said, let's go and get oh, about this trainer. Ho oh, oh, ho, punching bag. No, I'm not one of those either. Maybe you don't have a right one. Now you have clink. And that thing does not have like Levitate, nope, and let's just take it out. And the clang. And the clink clang. That's fine, that's gonna do nothing. I can heal that off easily. There we go. You taking on care of level 39 more more than Boris will be up with Dugger. Level 40. 
The tin piping is gonna be enough for the gym leader. Hey, we're having a break. No, you're not. You're having a battle instead, dude. Okay, okay. I'm gonna go in here up anyway for the gym leader. And cross. Oh, don't get confused for us. Let's hit the earthquake. No! Oh. The claw. But, yeah, no! Stop hitting yourself with confusion! Come on, please, 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 Time to finish yourself off with takedown. No. no, no, we're not swapping out. Titus can take on the freaking full job. And we've got the burn as well, so that helps. One more flame wheel. I'll go heal up and then take on the take on the gym leader and get our next badge. You want to learn Thunder Punch? I mean, it'll be ideal for water types. I'm really swift. Since when has Typhlosion been able to learn Thunder Punch? So new one on me guys, if you let, if you tell me which gen that came in, I would love to know. Now there's a few more gym leaders to take on, and a few more trains to take on, wow. Do you have what it takes, do you? I think I do. Take out that other kid. Another one. I don't know, we killed it. You are defeated, mate. I mean, with all this money, I don't mind going back to heal, but literally, like. I have two hyper patients, that's okay. I don't know they have four patients as well, so that's fine. Some papers left. Only strong trainers allowed three. You don't look strong. Oh, I've managed to make it this far with my team, so I think I am pretty strong. I have a magna zone. That thing is gonna have levitate, surely. 
people don't even want to think about, like, earthquake in that thing. Alright, well, we'll see. I think it's going to have levitate, though, or an air balloon. No, it doesn't have that either. Wow. Okay. Okay, alright, we've got level 40. And halfway to level 40, bloody one. Okay, okay, since you're feeling me, I'll tell you something. Apnea uses electric and light type Pokemon hits. Flying light type Volcarona is possibly his strongest Pokemon. It's flying light type. Okay. That's fine. I have things to deal with the flying light type. Let's quickly save the game. Let's take on this gym leader. Narrow is the path that leads to life. Well, why is the way that leads to destruction? Come on, try to show me the powerful current that runs from your brain to your heart. Show me. Now, this gym leader. See if you guys can figure out who he looks like from main series Pokemon games. That thing has levitate and an air balloon. But I am going to bite this thing and then I'm possibly going to avalanche it. Or maybe I don't need to. Maybe two bites would be enough. But then who's coming in next? Because I think I might need to like swap out afterwards Electros yes because that thing knows a few fire moves oh, we'll switch in Dugra because I know for a while this thing can learn like flamethrower I know my headbutt's done not going to do you have rocky helmet that's fine that's fine with me no, headbutt probably isn't going to do much damage to the thing, but... It's fine. It's fine. No, that's fine with me. Absolutely fine with me. Bring in you, and go flame wheel. No, nope, but then we go quick attack, take you out. Miss. Miss. Rocky Helmet is a good thing to have on a Pokemon. Oh, so close. And Frost. Which, if I remember rightly, is not a normal Amphros. I'm give quite a way just yet when it becomes. But there we go. It's not just a normal Amphros, it's a Mega Amphros. Don't know it's going to outspeed. Oh no! No, but Mega Amphros is bulky as anything. So please don't take him out. Real quick, Claw. Miss! Miss! Miss the Focus Blast! One more Earthquake! Bye bye, Amphros! I think, like, attacked once. And that Devire. That thing knows some fire moves as well. And that Devire. Take out. Pop the air balloon. That's a finch. What's gonna do more? Stab. There's the fire punch. Knew it could learn fire moves. That was a crit as well. Dream punch. That did some good damage. I was saying with my leftovers, thank you very much. One more drain punch and we should be done. One more drain punch. Come on. That device should be gone. Yes! We did that with only one casualty. As well. 38. Oh, nearly level 39. 
Have we not finished yet? Oh no, this thing. That's fine. I have Pokemon that know Thunder. Oh, wow! That is a sweet EV evolution! And Thunder Punch. That's such a cool EV evolution. Hmm, yeah, we can totally cannot be blinded. Um, <laughs> ah, thumb punch. So, if we need to. Fine. If we need to, like, revive Doug, I will. But I'm hoping we're not gonna need to. I'm not a fighting type in this game. <laughs> I've got confusion off the first time. Confuse, hit yourself with confusion. One more side beam. Well done, Moon Fu. Just get Moon Fu up to level 36. And then recover. Yes, you can then. Rather than teleport, you can have recover. Level 37. Amazing power. Thank you very much. I like your EV evolution. Amazing. Here, take this badge. You deserved it. The Zap badge. Is that bad? The soft love cap. Your Pokemon will now be level 55. Oh, and I want you to have this too. Give me a rocky helmet. I don't want to attach your Pokemon because the attached received recoil damage. Yep. My electrons won't be needing it anymore, so you can have it. So rather than getting a TM from you, I get friggin... I wonder if that's opened the door. I haven't opened it either. Hmm. I'm not too sure how to open that door. Oh. I did pretty good. Right, I need to... What is she doing here? She's the little girl that talked to her, the Pichu, that we were supposed to with the Pichu. Well, you are strong. Thanks. Oh, no, no, I can't talk to... to, to you! What the heck was that? What was exactly? You were the one that came and talked to me. On the other way around. Like, I mean, come on. Uh, I'm gonna heal up. It's fine. Well, um, I'll sort out the team in between episodes because I'm not doing it now. Oh, where did she run off to? You go up here. Yeah, there she is. With the small axe. And a revive. Okay, cool. A big thing over there, I don't know what it is, but it's blocking the path. It's a Pokemon, it's called a small axe. That trainer won't be able to get past the sink with my, my throat. <laughs> oh, hi! Yeah, d yeah, you said, <laughs> where are you standing there the whole time? Yeah, I was. I, 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 get back here. Right now. Onto our house. Yikes, it's you again. You followed me here. Well, you weren't acting a tad suspicious, you know. I'm sorry, I'm Hessa. I saw you fight a fight with Epa. I knew you were the one. Say what? But pardon me, I I mean well, you're strong as all. 
Thanks. So you were talking about some flute back there. How I needed to get past that thing? I, I'll tell you all about it. Come meet me outside Teal Cave. Uh -huh, I'll explain all of this. Okay. Oh, by the way, if you go into Teal Cave, that cave there, that's where you find Earthquake. I'm here. I'm listening. I need to tell you about this. I need your help. Nobody trusts me. Them signal workers are kidnapping electric Pokemon. They kidnap my little Pichu too. No! Please, you gotta, you gotta help me. I know them are bad men. We can stop them, please. And in return you'll give me the flu or something? Yeah, I promise you. Right, so what's your plan? Them signals took my Pichu to the factory and I saw where. But you can't get there without a special key. So I was thinking. There's too many signals in the factory. There's not so many in the teal cave. And the cave is dark. No one will stop you. I don't like where this is going. We're strong. You can do it. Beat them up and take some keys. Jeez, okay. Wait here. Right. Guys, we know where we're going next into teal cave. Um, I'm going to leave today's episode here. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll catch you guys next time on the next episode of Pokemon Imperium. Well, we may have another evolution on the team. I'll catch you guys next time. Bye!